as we know that we are studying one by one the phylums and here is the third phylum so we will study about the third phylums and uh, one some non cardiac phylums are here so first phylum so we have studied the phylum protozoa second porifera third cylindrata now fourth phylum we are going to study its characteristic features and the differentiations among the all previous phylums and now today is the years of fourth with fourth phylum so one by one so we will discuss here so that we can understand its characteristic features and as i try to know its differentiations and its main features that was that separate other phylum from to this phylum so one by one we will discuss with the help of the well level diagrams so here is the phylum phylums and platy helminthes so we will study here phylum 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 platy helminthes platy platy helminthes this is the phylum platy helminthes now we will tell me some characters we will see here characters characters of platy helminthes characters of platy helminthes so what is the characters of platy helminthes first of all so these animals are triploplastic means that body walls body is differentiate into three layers so these animals are these animals are triploblastic triploblastics in nature in triploblastic layer means the body differentiate into three layers now second features we will discuss about uh, triploblastic and dorsoventral uh, flattened forms animals are triploblastic dorsoventral dorsoventral ventral flattened dorsoventral flattened Dorsoventral flattened means body is as abdominally it is flattened that is why it is said to be the dorsoventral flattened forms. Now we will discuss about the backs, some back, back feet like tissue. Okay, from the backs, the backs means that flattened from the back sides. So abdominal side means that is flattened from the back side means the abdominal side. So here is the abdominal side. So we will try to understand that. So through that, so in at the abdominal side, we will see that so these animals are generally flattened in nature. So, and uh, so it is another concept. It's a have a tissue level organization. So body is tissue level. Tissue level. Tissue level body organization organization okay tissue level body organizations is found in this animal these animals and tissue level means that's a cell form tissue tissue forms organs uh, organs we can say that tissue level organizations is available here see in these uh, animals and the cult uh, that is a uh, level organization that is why these animals are called flattened animals that is why that is why these animals are called flattened animal flattened animals flattened animals so, okay so these <clears throat> are having so showing these animals are showing the bilateral symmetry means literally two lateral symmetrical is called uh, these are these these animals are these animals are showing bilateral bilateral symmetry Bilateral symmetries means that symmetrical point of view if you are discussing that is a left and right 
राइट हाफ ऑफ द बॉडी हैव सेम डिजाइन मीन्स लेफ्ट एंड राइट हाफ ऑफ द बॉडी हैव सेम डिजाइन दैट इज वाई इट दिस एनिमल्स आर कार्ड आर केप्ट इन बायोलेटरल सिमेट्रीज फॉर्म दैट इज दिस इन दिस पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू नो इंटरनल बॉडी कैविटी इज प्रेजेंट इन दिस एनिमल्स नो इंटरनल बॉडी कैविटी इज प्रेजेंट इन दिस एनिमल्स दैट इज वाई दिस एनिमल्स आर कार्ड सिलो ए सिलोमिक्स सिलोमिक्स ए सिलोमिक्स ओके सो नो इंटरनल इंटरनल बॉडी कैविटी आर सिलोम फाउंड आर फाउंड दैट इज वाई इट इज कॉल्ड ए सिलोमिक एनिमल्स ए सी सिलोमिक एनिमल एनिमल्स ओके दैट इज वाई दीज एनिमल्स आर कॉल्ड ए सिलोमिक एनिमल्स नेक्स्ट कैरेक्टर वी विल डिस्कस हेयर दे आर आदर फ्री लिविंग और पैरासाइटिक्स दे आर दे आर इधर फ्री लिविंग्स फ्री लिविंग्स और पैरासिटिक पैरासिटिक इन नेचर मीन्स थ्री लिविंग्स मीन्स द लिव्स इन वाटर और अदर प्लेसेज थ्री विथ वे डज नॉट हार्म्स एनी वे आर पैरासिटिक इन नेचर इफ दीज एनिमल्स आर फाउंड आर इन अ पैरासिटिक नेचर मीन्स दैट वी कैन से दैट दीज ट्रांसमिट डिजीज अन अदर पर्सन अटैक ऑन अन अदर एनिमल्स एंड आल्सो सॉक फॉर देवल्स लिविंग बींग्स एंड सर्वाइवल्स दे विल्स ऑलवेज मेक अ हास्ट अ टू अन अदर एनिमल्स लाइक प्लेनेरिया लिव प्लेटी सॉरी प्लेनेरिया टेप Worms, tape worms, that is Tinea soliums. This is also uh, these animals are, is also found in the pork, pork in the in the flesh of the pork. That is why it's, it's uh, generally found in and that causes the disease in the intestine. So example we will take here examples of these animals. Examples. Here is we will describe the examples of these animals. Is first here is Planaria liver flukes, Planaria. ओके टीनिया टीनिया सोलियम ओके फैसीओला हिपैटिका फैसीओला ही पैटिका फैसीओला हिपैटिका दीज आर दीनिया सोलियम प्लेन एरिया फैसीओला लिवर हिपैटिका लिवर फ्लोक्स इट्स ऑल्सो सेट विद लीवर फ्लोक्स ओके These are the these are the animals. Now we will discuss about and discuss with the help of the level level diagrams. Is given we will draw here the level level diagrams of the some animals and that was concluded and included in in it. These animals are first we will draw here the structures of the <coughs> structure of the planaria liver flukes. Uh, so here is the structures we are going to draw the structures. Uh, this is this is the. This is the structures of liver fluke. This, so we can say that this animals as a structurally are okay. And uh, we will draw here structures so that it uh, cannot get confusions. more and give the better performance to understand things because feature is just like this we can say here that sir uh, these are the body structures i structures is seen so surrounding here and if we are going to design the bodies we will see that sir so these are the body structures one by one so we are Going to first of all draw here so that planaria liver flukes. These liver flukes have a body. Here is the internal organ is also found here. We can say and if we are design the body, we will see that so these are the just like a body cavity like structures can be seen. These are the structures we have drawn here. The structures of the Uh, structures of the animals and uh, we will label here so this is called eye eyes okay 
दीज आर आईज एंड सेकेंड इन स्ट्रक्चर से हियर इज वी कैन से हियर ब्रांच द गैस्ट्रोवेस्कुलर कैविटी इज अवेलेबल हियर हियर ब्रांच ब्रांच गैस्ट्रो वैस्कुलर ब्रांच गैस्ट्रो वैस्कुलर कैविटी is present here here is the structures we will see that sir it is the pharynx structures pharynx this is uh, this is the mouth 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 is available and the anus is also here available these are the body structures we have drawn here is this is the structure of the plain area plain area if we are drawing some other another structures of some animals here so we will see that so another animals we will also draw here so uh, 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 another structures we can draw here so with the help of the well label diagram diagrams and here is the place and with the, in this place we will try to draw the another structures of the liver flukes we will see here the liver flukes uh, can be drawn here in the liver flux the structures we will see here so dome empty structures can be see here so it's a liver flux okay so these are the structures and here we will see that this is the acetabulum acetabulum this is the acetabulum and these structures can be seen like this and uh, suppose that we are going to draw tinea solium so this is the structure of structure of liver fluke okay now we'll draw the structures of tinea solium or uh, tapeworms here is the collex we will see the tinea solium so is collex these are the structures if we see these are the body structures can be seen these are the structures of tinea solium and also can be seen structurally and the form the body structures of the tinea solium these are the structures of the tinea solium so we can see it's a clearly the structures of the tinea solium and also uh, try to uh, write the name of the tinea solium and these uh, these tinea solium on the basis of this structures we will draw here the scolex sucker and these are the structures of tinea solium i hope so you will see its tinea solium here is the structures so that is called scolex scolex succors these are scolex and this is some tapes on tape on like it's a body 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 just like a tape tape like a body scolex is ever here and the sucker is also ever here so that sucks the any substances and generally these animals are found so in or such as animals and flesh and if we are taking the place of such animals we are suffering from the some different types of the disease and so we have to take care of ourselves before eating such types of animals these are the characters of the phylums uh phylums Platy helminthes and many others are also say in animals are available here in a platy helminthes that can create a problems because they are parasitic in nature generally and some are also not a parasitic animals I, as I have discovered here so they are free living animals also they are free living animals also available here in these phylums okay thank you very much okay bye bye